Is your face showing the signs of aging? Sunken in cheeks, lines between the nose and mouth, and even forehead wrinkles can make you look older than you actually are. One option for restoring a youthful appearance is fat grafting. Here to tell us more about it is Dr. Beth Collins, a double board certified plastic and reconstructive surgeon with a practice in Guilford. Dr. Collins, thanks so much for being here. Hi, good to um, see you again. First, let's start off telling me about your practice. Well, I have a practice in Guilford. I do um, surgeries along in the Yale Hospital, so um, I do a lot of uh, focus on cosmetic surgery and some reconstructive breast surgery, but mm -hmm. I think we're here today to talk about the cosmetic aspect of yeah, the Yeah, the practice. fat grafting. This sounds pretty yeah. incredible. So basically, you could take fat from where you don't want it and put it into your face? Yes. That's Precisely. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. So fat grafting has um, been used a lot in, in all sorts of branches of medicine, but mm -hmm. the nice thing about it is it, you can take it from your belly if you have a little bit extra there, your flanks, your thigh, whatever it is, uh -huh. and you could inject it into areas where um, you're deficient. And part of the signs of aging in your face is loss of volume. Mm -hmm. So we do some of that replacement of volume with commercially available fillers, but you can actually do it with your own fat. Is it safe? for that way? Um, I don't know if I'd call it safer. It's mm -hmm. just a little bit different. Okay. Um, so when you put the fat in, you have to put it in in little little aliquot, little layers, um, okay. and then it sets up and takes as a graph. So the par the portion of it that takes mm -hmm. is permanent. Wow. Um, occasionally, you have to come back and do a couple of treatments. Um, so it may take one or two times going back to do a fat grafting procedure. But once you get to your final result, you know that that's going to last, and you've wow. restored that facial volume permanently. So it's a little bit, you know, more a little bit more invasive than mm -hmm. the commercial fillers, but then again, you you may not have to keep doing it. And it, it lasts ever. forever. And That's great. Lasts. Is it a painful experience or not no, so much? No, no, it's not not painful at all. Actually, we um, I do it in my office. Oh, so, so you don't even have to go to the hospital or anything. No, no, you don't. I could do um, local anesthesia just in some areas on the face, and then it's completely painless. Wow. All right. Well, we have to look at the before and after yeah, pictures because these are really impressive, doctor. Just tell us. Uh, what we're looking at here. So this is a lady I did actually last week, and her before picture is there. Uh, in her after picture, that is two minutes after her oh procedure. Oh my goodness! And you so, can see the results absolutely. already. Absolutely, yeah. And I wanted to show that because it, there she is, wide awake, um, and the. The result is instant, not a whole lot of swelling. People ask me what the downtime is. The, the downside to this is you can get some bruising, but it's mm -hmm. not terribly common, and there she is. She had a tiny bit of bruising, but you can't even really see it. She can go back to it. work if she wanted to. Absolutely, <laughs> and, I, and she, act, she actually went, um, went away the next, she's going away today. I oh, think wow. she's <laughs> yeah, yeah, look. just ready to go. Um, and then there's uh, two more. Wow, yes. that's dramatic. Yes. So I mean, you could see kind of the thinning underneath her eyes, absolutely. right? Absolutely. The nice thing is sometimes you see those um, dark rings under your eyes, and that is sometimes from pigmentation of the skin, but mm -hmm. most of the time it's actually from shadowing, from losing mm -hmm. volume. So if you replace that volume, those shadows and those deep circles go away. So that's really changed this yeah. lady. Um, and wow. subtly. It takes years off your life, though, it seems yes, like, absolutely. right? Yes, absolutely. For your age, at least. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right, let's look at the last change, one. But yeah, and so here's another lady. Same problem. Now, in this lady, I did a little bit more, because you can combine this procedure with others. Okay. In this particular lady she had some extra skin as well as the shadowing so I did a lower lid blepharoplasty and um, just augmented that with a little fat grafting and I think really transformed her she looks That's like, like this, two different people yeah it is I mean you're still gonna look like yourself <laughs> right right and natural but, you tell. but but it is it really does change the way you are for the better I think yeah absolutely and I think it's fantastic you can go right to your office and do it absolutely that's great yeah. all right dr. Colin thanks so much for all the information yeah let's put it up on the screen if you're interested on about fat grafting you could just call dr. Collins at 203-689-5295 or visit bethcollinsmd.com again thanks for all the info thank you all right up next Neil Fuentes and Bill, uh, Neil Fuentes is over in the kitchen no Billy today but first take a look at this